The Stevens Point Brewery has a wide variety of beer, sodas, and prides itself as being the fifth oldest brewery in the United States. But did you know our popular hometown spectacle is an international company? Today we take a look at this brewery's process from boiling hops to a frosty mug of beer. The brewery itself was established in 1857 and even supplied beer to the troops during the Civil War. During the 1920s, the Point Brewery was able to survive Prohibition by producing near beer and soft drinks. By 1933, Prohibition ended and the brewery was able to continue working on beer products. Forty years later, the staple beer of the brewery, Point Special, was named as number one American beer in a taste test conducted by the Chicago Daily News. And since then, Point has added numerous beers to their collection and construction has been done to expand the brewery. Today, the brew goes through three different vessels. The mash tun, which starts the conversion of starch to sugar. The lauder tun, which pulls liquid from the barley and the brew kettle, which boils and then hops are added. Depending on what brew is being made, different types of hops are used. The beer flows through the aging tanks where it is kept at 34 degrees, unpasteurized for two to three weeks. The Point Brewery currently has 20 aging tanks. Point buys their tanks locally from a plant in Elroy. Point creates many of its own brews, but outsources its brewery to other companies and receives ingredients from multiple sources. After the brewing process, the beer is bottled and packaged. From there, the Point beer is distributed throughout Wisconsin, but is also distributed throughout America and some parts of Great Britain. 